Hi. Hello. This is what we're gonna play in now. Loco motive. No, I believe it is like a um, murder mystery. Murder mystery, yes. We very, shall see if it works. Very pixelated murder mystery. I really like that style. Yes, it just worked. Okay. New game. All right. Click. Is this an itchio game? Yes. Mm. Somewhere deep in Switzerland. Nice. 1939. Oh, the dreaded 39 year. On the oh, that Ooh, popped up fast in the room of Arthur Ackerman. Nice meal. Mm. That should do it. <gasps> stab. Hello. <laughs> Yikes. Oh no, stab. My apologies, oh. Mr. Ackerman. You startled me. Call me Arthur. You're the estate attorney, yes? I'm. Breaking and entering. <gasps> I'm under orders, I'm afraid. This comes direct from Lady Unterwald. Mm -hmm. Of course. Letter on the side table for you, sir. Mm. And the suit carrier? For you as well, sir. She was quite insistent. She certainly has her ways. Of course, sir. Well, I'll leave you to it. <laughs> Bye. I wonder what Lady Unterwald has in store for me this time. Mm -hmm. I think this is cute. So can I move? So I'll point and click. Ooh, point and click. Nice. Okay, so. Nothing but hills. These flowers must be a gift from Lady Unterwald. Is it Wald or Wald? Unterwald? Well, I mean, I don't know. It, if it's... I don't know swish swish. I do not know Swiss names. Tiny sink for a tiny room. But that's probably not a Swiss name. Read the letter. Tripled. Can I look at myself? My trusty typewriter. Uh -huh. Dear Mr. Ackerman, please report to me in the lounge at your earliest convenience. I have further amendments to make before the big announcement tonight. So you're, I'm an attorney. When you're on one of my trains, I'd like everyone to come away with a smile on their face. Mm. And a new story to tell. As it's impossible for anyone to have a good time while looking so drab. I've made appropriate arrangements. Yours sincerely, Lady Unterwald. P.S. Don't startle Maurice if you find him delivering this message. He has a heart condition. He's gonna be the dead one. Have a good time. What on earth does she mean? It's a sofa that conveniently flips into a bed. What's going on up at the top of the screen? Oh, okay. Inventory. And so. Huh. And a okay. seven eggs. Cool. Nice. So are you supposed to get chained? I'm getting suited up. Looks like Ooh. I'm expected to wear this. What if it was like a bikini? <laughs> what if it was like something a ridiculous? Lovely leopard skin g Nice! Snazzy. Snazzy. <laughs> it's a mirror. <laughs> Metal clothes hanger. Well, I'm going to take that. You never know when you're going to need a metal hanger. To stab somebody in the throat with. <laughs> oh, it conveniently fit. I've never been on a train, have you? Mm, once years it's ago. It's like... Oh. It's like one of the things I want to do. I want to go on a train. Because when Look you live... world. Mm. Arthur A. Ackerman has some intense lawyering to do. And he's dressed to impress. Because at least when... Adversary proceeding. When you lived where I lived in Pennsylvania, you had really no need to use a train. You haven't misplaced my room key, sir? Your room keys, sir? Misplaced, my good friend. Must I remind you of who I am? <laughs> and who is that, sir? Tis I, Herman Merman, <laughs> world famous detective. Now you get to voice act. Perhaps you've read the stories of my cases. Herman Merman and the Murmuring German. <laughs> Herman Merman and the, the Squirming German. Mm. Sorry, sir. Not a big reader. 
Not even Herman Merman and the Sermon of Vermin? No, I love it. Good God. My point <laughs> being, I don't misplace things. Mm -hmm. I solve them. That's excellent news, sir. I'm sure you'll have no problem with the case of the missing keys. Well... Um... <laughs> yes, you're quite right. No, Daddy mentions it. I did see that drunkard stumbling the halls earlier this evening. Maybe you'll have a voice heavy. So yeah. sorry, I don't do autographs. <laughs> um, wait a moment, I know you. You're that estate lawyer from Lady Unterwald. Ackerman, is it? That's right. Levi Ackerman. Yeah. <laughs> you lost the keys to your room? I hear you're a bit of a dick. <laughs> I love it. I hear you're a bit of a dick? Yeah. <laughs> I, I, yes. I hear you're a bit of a dick. Oh, I get it. Cause you get it? Because it's a tactic of, yeah. You could say that I'm the biggest <laughs> dick in the continental <laughs> Europe. Uh, they don't come any bigger than this gumshoe. Yeah, gumshoe. That's cute. I like that that was an option. How do you know Lady Interwald? Let's just say we're both mutual benefactors of Lady Interwald. Oh. Eccentric interest eccentricity. In she uses my private detective services to keep tabs on her extended family. And she uses your estate management services to write them out of any undeserved inheritance. <laughs> oh dear. She did write out her cousin for chewing too loudly that one time. Oh totally do that. Oh yes. She's <laughs> as mad as a box of frogs. <laughs> oh my god. But if you want to inherit wealth, power, and influence, there's a cat at the window, you play by her rules. You gonna let her in? No. Oh, wait, who? Salem. Oh, where's she at? Oh. You've lost the keys to your room. Lost them? No. There's definitely foul play at work. Oh, no. I smell a rat. And I'm going to sniff them out. If my name isn't Herman Merman. Is it? Of course it is. <laughs> I've got to go. Lady Unterwald is waiting for me. Best be off then. She's not one for waiting. Yum 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 yum. Just in case she's got dirty paws. Okay, so. Okay, now I click to walk. <laughs> I tried to talk to him and he just said no. <laughs> Diamond care. This was an itchio? Mm -hmm. It's so cute. Oh, there's a woman you can voice act. Smoking okay. lady. Hello. <laughs> Arthur Ackerman, at your service. The name's Suzanne Goldschmidt. How can I help you, Arthur? <laughs> Why is she smoking? <laughs> what do you mean? Huh? What did you say? She's a smoking lady. <laughs> no, I'm laughing at this option. Oh. Looking for a good time. No. Oh. <laughs> Fuck it, why not? I'm looking for a good time. Ugh, I'm not that kind of girl. <laughs> no, I mean... I've been <laughs> enjoying enjoy my... myself. I can tell you don't need me for that. <laughs> that is, uh... Are you alright? What does it people do to have fun here? Here? Yeah? Nothing out of the ordinary. We partake in the pleasures of life. Well, do you have any advice? Don't smoke. <laughs> Make new friends. Break a few rules. Nice. Like this woman. Great new memories. Beautiful. Eat. Nice. Drink. Smoke. Fuck. Fuck. <laughs> <Got it>. Thank you. <sighs> Tell me, Arthur, have you always been such a square? <laughs> well, she was the one who's been a square. I take no issue with the square. Straight angles. All sides equal. Perfectly reliable for a shape. Reliable is an interesting author. 
I prefer to talk with people a little more rounded. Hmm. I'm interesting. I'm rounded. <laughs> now, if you'll excuse me, I have an old lady waiting for me. <laughs> I have an old lady waiting. I thought that was fun. Yeah, the dialogue is pretty good so far. Hi. Another round of city juice, old chap. I don't work here. Then why are you wearing blue? Hmm. Well, an old lady told me to get dressed into it. I'm all right. I don't want to know. <laughs> Besides, you're killing my vibe with that sweet patootie over there. <laughs> you dig? Uh, <laughs> I, <believe. laughs> I love it. Uh. <laughs> That's pretty good. Hello there. The name's Bergman. Hello there. Ackerman, isn't it? That's right. Lady Unterwald talks up a storm about you. Really? What does she say? She says your work ethic is unquestionable. That's quite the compliment. That's quite the compliment coming from her. Be careful though, lad. You're in her good books today, but she'll turn on a dime. Daughter. Hey there. The name's Diana Osterhagen. Pleased to make your acquaintance. You're the lawyer guy, right? That's me. Arthur Ackerman, attorney at law. There's not a large turnout for the big announcement tonight. Yes, I'm afraid Luna Udenwald is estranged from her large number of her family. Because her personal lawyer keeps writing them out of the inheritance. Uh-oh. I'm well aware. Well. Relax, as someone that married into this family. I can tell you they're all absolutely mad. Oh, looks like I'm <laughs> trying to write people out of her will. <laughs> twin one and twin Probably one. so that she'll leave it all to me. Who do you think's gonna die? Mm. Hi there. <gasps> oh. Hello. Hello. I'm guessing Lady Unterwald's gonna die tonight. She was talking to me. He was talking to me. Why would he talk to you? He was clearly talking to me. Well, I guess I was talking to both of you. Both of us? At once? For what? Indeed. <laughs> What a peculiar thing to say. Very strange. Barstu, Barstu, Barstu. Can you talk to the barman? The barman. Ha, oh, I didn't even know his name was Barman. Hello. Barman. <laughs> What'll it be? Mm. Hmm. Ooh. Oh, wine, Java wine. <laughs> so what do we have? That's perfect. Ah, uh, well. Hey. I could always go for a cup of coffee. Really? Yeah. A strong cup, a strong coffee, please. Please. Mm. <laughs> oh, <laughs> he just put he's, in his jacket. I don't know. Did he? Yeah. So Can you I get have anything a else? Steaming hot with coffee in my in my bedroom. Can I take the wine? I don't know. Maybe. If you can. Yeah. Do it. Head at the door. Glass of red. Glass of red. Do it. Ooh. This uh -huh. one has sound effects. Ooh. Does it? What? I didn't hear it. I hope this suit isn't a rental. <laughs> oh, he just put oh. the wine glasses. Did you hear that? Yep. Oh, no, baby. Just, they won't mind if I borrow this. He just took the recorker off the bar. <laughs> what a thief. The recorker? The recorking wine here? <laughs> Hello, cat. Okay, I'll take it. Cats everywhere. Hmm. She probably wants to pick on my lap. She probably does. Well, that must be her. Deaf woman. Come on. <laughs> Look at her in the video. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. She's such a dummy. Don't be eating my... <laughs> okay. Oh, Salem. Talk to a deaf woman. Hello, I'm Arthur Ackerman. What? I'm an attorney at law. You're a terrible boy. Ackerman. Arthur Ackerman. Martha Slackerman? You don't look like a Martha to me. 
Are you doing this on purpose? Who's to say? <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna leave now. <laughs> I like her. She's got spunk. Smartly dressed men. Hello, I'm Arthur Ackerman. I'm Dr. Hirsch. Lady Unterwald's personal doctor. Dr. Hirsch? Hirsch! H-I-R-S-C-H. Sorry. Don't worry. I get that all the time. Is Lady Unterwald in need of medical assistance? Oh no. She's exceedingly spry for her age. She likes to keep me on hand. On retainer, if you will. Aye. Just how old is Lady Unterwald? I've always been too afraid to ask, honestly. Ah. That's doctor patient confidentiality, I'm afraid. But I'm sure tonight's speech is her way of saying she knows to slow things down a bit. Goodbye. I'm taking video of her. She's so cute. She does have a cute little face. Mm -hmm. Nice to <laughs> meet you. I'm too sober for this conversation. I might need to get on his level. No, no. Oh, can I just drink the wine more? <gasps> really? No. Can you do anything with it? <gasps> I don't want to make him oh, any more inebriated. Oh, so you can give items to people. Oh, can I give him coffee? Maybe. I don't know. We can't use those together. He wouldn't like that. Okay, this must be her. Lady Unterwald. Ah, Arthur, there you are. Are you ready to help me with these amendments? I'm ready and willing. <laughs> Is that another one of your lawyer jokes? Yes. <laughs> and then she died. And the deck's gonna pin it on me. Thank you for coming, Arthur. I trust you're enjoying yourself. As ordered, Lady Underwald. <laughs> that was a good one. But when you get to be my age, you realize there's more to life than paperwork and legalize. Legalese. Legalese. Yes, Speaking of which, there's the amended will. I need you to keep it safe for me. I'll keep it in the briefcase, ma'am. I expect the speech tonight will ruffle some feathers. Hmm. Ma'am? All those fools out there. You really think any of them are cut out to take over the reins? Bickering psychophants, the lot of them. With far too much self-important. They're just waiting for me to kick the bucket. It makes my blood boil just thinking about it. Open the window, will you, Arthur? I need some air. Oh, I know what's gonna happen. You think she's gonna fall out? She's gonna the fly gonna Oh fly no! Out. The wheel's gonna fly out? Oh shit. Oh, oh fuck. fuck. Oh no. Oh, that's much better. Then she's gonna die. Yeah, it's funny. You might just be the most useful person on here. Person here, Arthur. Can't talk, because I'm old. I can always <laughs> rely on you. <laughs> now it's time to gather the family. <laughs> This old lady's got a speech to make. Yeah, someone's oh. going to kill her because of what's written in the will, but now the will's gone, so... <laughs> oh, no. Why can't you just make up another one, like, right now? Yeah, he's a lawyer. Yeah, it's like, hello. That was, like, the whole reason. And usually they have the a The will's caught copy. on the window. Oh. <laughs> I might still have to them to grab it. Arthur! Arthur! Stop dilly-dallying! Oh, my God. Coming. Oh, my God. The lights are probably going to go out. And all be... right. Let us begin. Thank you all for coming. You know me as the aging heiress of the Waldbahn Empire. Waldbahn. Huh? There comes a day for everyone when you know your time is up. It's my desire Oops. to end for that reason. <laughs> woo woo! <laughs> Look at this no, candy I know. It looks like we're approaching a tunnel. Oh, yeah, and she's, totally she's gonna, gonna die. Murder. Ahem. And for that reason, 
It's my desire that my estate be passed over to in its entirety to then she's in a bloody ah Lady on the wall wait it could just be a flesh wound <laughs> <laughs> Oh that's good that's 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 good that's I wish it would have went yeah, a little more yeah. a little bit more Ladies and gentlemen, there there's a been a murder most foul. A murder so wicked and dastardly. Oh my god. <laughs> that it can only be solved mm. by an extraordinary detective. Such as that. Herman Merman. Herman Merman. Mm -hmm. Herbert Fink Farm? Herbert Mink Farm? Lady Unterwald had ridden someone out of her inheritance mere moments before her demise. We can prove motive. With one key piece of evidence, Mr. Ackerman. Yes. You were safekeeping her will and testament. I see. Apart from myself, you hold the key to who killed Lady Unterwald. Please hand it over to me now. Uh. Uh. I can see, I can see it from here. <laughs> uh. I must have left it in my other pair of pants. I can see it from here. Get it. Do it down. Keep going. Mm. Well, I can see it from here. Do you not possess the will currently? Nevertheless, I shall continue. Ladies and gentlemen, I have been watching tonight's proceedings with a keen eye. And I shall reveal how I know the killer is in this very room. Yeah, the classic Caluso thing. Is that her? Is it? It's not me. Hmm. But I have nowhere to hide. Woo woo. Oh He's no, gonna be murdered. Gonna die. Is he gonna be murdered too? Oh, it's, <laughs> also, you know, it's, it's like the Futurama episode where Leela's impulsive and she keeps turning off the light and stabbing someone. Killer her is. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> nice. Well then, what now? <laughs> it's just... Uh, habeas corpus. Well. Oh my god, that is amazing. Will. Herman Merman said I was the only other person who could reveal the killer. Mm. I need to find out who killed both him and Lady Underwald. And get that will back. Or I could be the next to go. I need to check their quarters, see if there's any clues. But how do I get in? Can I not just grab the will? Get it! It's right, oh, there. it's right there. Get it! I need something to grab. I got a hook. Oh. Ooh, you got a hook? You have ah. frick! I got a hanger. You okay? We'll get get your thing maybe. And then like you know, get it. Can't use Why it. Why not? Yeah. Get the. Uh, Can't use uh, those together. Uh, Okay, I gotta look for something else. Shoot! Well, I'm gonna go to her quarters. Mm -hmm. Oh, you bastard. No entry, I'm afraid. Eep. It could be him. Think so? Maybe. Smart ass attendant. And he was being real fishy. Oh, he doesn't have his blood splatter on him. Could be any of these fuckers. Hmm. It's not locked. Oh, it is. There's this room. It's locked. Nothing but mm. sleeper carriages in there. And besides, there's a killer on the loose. Oh, yeah, we don't want to go to sleep. Oh, what's in my corners? <clears throat> Flowers must be a gift from Lady Unterwald. It's a typewriter, my luggage. Any room, mirror. Hmm. I tried combining that shot. Maybe she killed herself. Yeah, she just stabbed herself in the back. Okay, can I use the coat hanger to pick the lock? <gasps> hmm. Hmm. Can't use it. There's another door here that's locked as well. Did anybody. Well, maybe talk to everybody again and maybe you can start offloading some of yeah. those items. 
Suzanne Hi. Goldschmidt. How can I help you, Arthur? Suzanne, tell me what to do. <laughs> if I was you, I'd probably try to get that will back. No shit. Thanks. Hi. Hey, make yourself useful. Take this note and give it to the lady behind me, will you? And don't forget to give her any, give her my room key too. Mm. Have it out. Sleaze ball. <laughs> Can I read it? No, probably not. Strongly perfumed love note. Well, you know what? I'm gonna look in his room first. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Sure. Dumb asshole. <laughs> what a dumb. Sleaze balls are in. <laughs> what does it say? Worn something? Worn boxers or something? Oh, there's a bra there. Leftover food. What a slob. Worn shorts. Hastily removed. Uh huh. There's a bra. I want to see the bra. Lipstick stained mirror. Oh, shit. Mirror or bra? <clears throat> Unmentionables. That's a bra. Is this room just a joke room? <clears throat> oh, he's a sleaze ball. So who was he uh, mm -hmm. procreating with before? A lady. Or perhaps a man who dresses like a lady. Or perhaps a lady who is not born a lady. Who knows? <laughs> a lady who was a porn lady? <laughs> who, who, wasn't, who, was, who was not born a lady. Ah. <laughs> anyway, gotta give her the shit. Might oh, as well yeah. give her the key too. This is for you. Is this from the twit that's been making eyes at me all evening? I'd sooner jump out this carriage window than rendezvous with that run egg. It's perfumed, at least. Well, it certainly stinks of desperation. Just take it. <laughs> oh, wait, the room key, too. We need the room key. Take this key. She wouldn't <laughs> All right. like that. Well, there you go. So let's... He wouldn't like that. Well, there you go. That's, I think that's him. all you can do. He probably wouldn't want it back. I bet I can give it to someone else. You think? <laughs> That'd be funny. Hello there. Oh, Arthur. Can you believe it? What a messy state of affairs we all find ourselves in. My feeling exactly. You know, I was wondering why there was also a detective. Mm. I was like, well, if he's a detective, then we're just going to be, you know, sitting back, right? That was funny that he died. Who do you think the murderer is? I wouldn't like to take any guesses at this point. I'm ideally hoping to stay out of proceedings mm. if at all possible. Mm. Nothing's worse than making a target of yourself in a room with a trapped killer. <laughs> Who would want to kill Lady Winterval? <laughs> it's the same question. Well, Arthur, when you generate as much wealth, power, and influence as she did, you naturally create a few enemies along the way. I can't believe they killed Herman Mervyn. <laughs> Rather foolish of him to paint that target on your back, I thought. Surely the killer among us will be trying to tie up any loose ends. And you're probably looking like a particularly loose end. If you don't mind me saying. Uh, mm -hmm. After this conversation. Goodbye. It's kind of funny that they did it in a tunnel. Only because, like, why would the lights go out? Like, if, if there's lights in the train, illuminating the train, why would they go out in a tunnel? I don't know how electricity worked on trains back then. Oh. It's probably just comic relief. Like yeah, comic I, I know, but I'm just like, really? Like, a whole bunch of shit doesn't make sense in all those old comedy movies. Like, stuff that happens and you're like, that doesn't make any sense. Mm. Like, no one complains about Buster Keaton's movies, even though they didn't make any sense. Because they were brilliant. <laughs> Hello again. Didn't I tell you, Arthur? Totally mad, the lot of them. I didn't expect them to go this far, though. <laughs> Someone on this train must have had a real axe to grind. You think you know who did it? I'd bet money on those really creepy twins, personally. Go on. Their constant one-upmanship with each other's get gets tiring. Gets tired. I can't talk. I saw them argue over a designer bag they found once. They argued back and forth for hours, chucking at it. That poor bag didn't stand a chance. Interesting. I can't believe Lady Intervald is gone. Sorry, Arthur. I know you two were close in some ways. 
I guess you're out of a cushy job now, too. Oh, dear. I didn't even think of that. <laughs> Whoops. Poor Herman Merman. Parading around like that. He was practically asking for it. Especially as he'd likely spied on half the people aboard this train. Goodbye. Talk to these weirdos. <laughs> Hi there. Oh, we don't even Hello. know their names. Hello. Like just twin and one and two. I'm uh, sorry for your loss. I can't believe she's gone. I was her favorite, you know. No, she told me I was her favorite. I think you switched her voices, but that's she okay. probably just confused <laughs> you for me. <laughs> eh, it works. Mm. Oh, bartender. What'll it be? It was the bartender. Never mind. He did it. I think you need to do something with the drinks just at some point. Probably. Hello. Good evening, sir. Do you know what he's been drinking over there? I believe it's an almost lethal combination of ethanol and assorted plant fiber. What a, with a dose of caffeine. Mixed to perfection, of course. He calls it the rosebud. You have both of those Mwah. drinks. Can I get a rosebud? Mwah. You'll have to ask at the bar, sir. Hmm. Wow. It's what, red wine and coffee? That's basically what it is? Yeah. Well, let be. A rosebud, please. Sorry, sir. We don't we don't have the petal leaf to make it. Mr. <laughs> Mason drunk our entire supply. I'm afraid we're all out. What if I get you the ingredients? Can you make it then? I might be able to whip something up whip something similar up. Okay, well. Dude, is it the <laughs> is it literally just those two? Mm. There you go. Oh, really? This shit I got from him earlier, so I need a petal, a, a petal, a leaf, a petal leaf. So. Um, what? Well, keep talking to people. Hello, old lady. <laughs> There's a murderer on the loose. What? No servers in the caboose? I'm going to leave now. <laughs> Hello. How are you doing, Dr. Hirsch? That's all. That's all. Th that's all they're going to call me from now on, isn't it? Dr. Hearse. <laughs> the doctor of death who failed to save it's Lady Hearse. Unterwald. Dr. Hearse. Dr. Hearse. We call him Because his name is Hirsch. Yes. Yeah. Despite standing right next to him, there's nothing I could have done. Mm. Who do you think the murderer is? It's -a me. I was hoping you could tell us. Oh. I'm working on it. Well, be quick about it, Mr. Ackerman. Plenty of dark tunnels in the route ahead. <laughs> and we're all locked in with a killer. Who would you want... To, who would want to kill Lady Unterwald? Who would you want to kill Lady <laughs> If you could make any... Lady Unterwald cut, cut a lot of people out of her will, you know. When there's wealth, power, and influence to pay for, people tend to go a bit loco. <laughs> Motive. <laughs> oh. Hmm. I can't believe they killed Herman Merman. Herman must have got too close to the truth. Not to mention he was doing Lady Unterwald's oh. dirty work. <laughs> I was saying that the wrong way. He was doing what Lady Unterwald. in the dirty. Scandalous. <laughs> is it oh. still? So, yep, it's still hanging around out there. Herman mentioned you stumbling around the halls earlier. Did you see something? Hmm. Mwah. <gasps> Perhaps. <gasps> Out with it, man. What do you know? Uh, here's some thing last night. I'm too sober for this conversation. I might need to get on his level. Okay, so I Oh, he needs the rosebud, though. Yeah. So I need a leaf. Mm. Hello, man. Sorry, sir. They don't want to quarters. It's strictly You have house. roses in your. Do I? Yeah, you have oh, roses. Oh shit, that's right. You have roses in your uh, thing. Let me through. There might be a key evidence in our quarters. Key. Can't do that, sir. Pretty please let me in. Sorry, sir. No can do. Pretty pretty please with a cherry on top? With a cherry on top? Hmm. <laughs> Alright, go ahead. Oh, really? Really? No. <laughs> 
Mm. Nobody is getting past me as long as I'm standing here. Well, I gotta mm. move him somehow then. Why haven't we stopped the train? I think she's amused at her to our talking. Mm. What is that to keep this place going until we reach the train? Blah blah blah. Please, blah blah blah. <laughs> We've continued there. We've contained the area. The killer has nowhere to go from here, but here. Nowhere from here. I don't fucking know. <laughs> but we're in the area. <laughs> ah, just go to your room. You need to find a way to convince the guard. Well, first, it seems like you need a rosebud first. So. Yep. Rosebud. What uh, movie is that from? Citizen Kim. <gasps> Never watched it. He's got a little thing on his eating. Grilled beef, beef, beef with vegetables. He's got to get in there and get with the woman. I love grilled beef and vegetables. So, I gotta, I gotta get him away from his table. Well, Which means I gotta give the letter to someone and be like, no, 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 Look at this stupid cat. Can I just put it in the thing? I don't know. You just look at the flowers and you're like, hmm, flowers. Oh. Can't do nothing. No? Nope. Really? Can you put anything? What about the wine and the coffee? I tried that. Oh, for real? Oh, no. You put the wine. Did you try the wine next to it, too? I did. Yeah, that is not the solution. Uh, what? I can't think of anything else though, but you need a pedal. I'll try that cage room again. Alright. Cause I mean you have his key. Hmm. 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 Did you talk to the bartender again? Just I did. And he said I need something similar. That's like the only thing I can think of. Could you give the wine to him? To That's him? Him. Okay, I don't want to make him any more inebriated. Hmm. Hmm. I tried to grab it again. <laughs> and it's gone. <laughs> Forever. Okay, Kat, you going? Hmm. She's going. can't think of what uh, to do. Well, oh, nice. she's just laying on the floor. That's too warm. Yeah, I'm warm. I'm pretty warm. Huh. Should I look up the sauce? No. Well, I'm gonna look up the hair just for my own satisfaction. Take the horn. Oh, you take the horn. Nice. Yoink. <laughs> I wonder this why. would probably make an amazing goblet. If there was some way to seal it. I got the corking device. <gasps> if it wasn't so gross. Ew. I, have I heard yeah. that. <laughs> the liquid would pour straight through. Apparently this was made in two weeks. There, corked. <coughs> the horn is sealed. Okay. So. Wire. Okay, that's a start. start. Oh, put the coffee in. Yep. Gross. I think I need one more. Yeah, yeah he needs a pedal or something. Or beef. 
<clears throat> there, there was like a there was a vegetable on the on the beef. Oh, so maybe that. And there was extra in his room. There it is. So grab it. Um. Oh my. Damn. Let's move towards. Oh, she opened the Did she? Yeah. I should have just said it was a ghost. There's a network error. Please try again. Hmm. Well, this is. Might be on my end. Uh oh. Uh oh. Spaghetti. Oh, fuck. Are we playing to nobody? Oh well, it's still recording, so it doesn't really matter. To the sleeper carriage. To sleep ball, sleep ball. It's cool. There's the will. Oh, nice. Be able to reach it. Get it. Get it. Oh, I've got hair all over myself. Uh oh. Hmm. <sighs> the latch is jammed. Looks like I could force something thin and wiry into the gap through. <laughs> it just might wedge it open. I don't well, know I if I have anything like that. Coat hanger. Perfect from, for removing all kinds of things. Mm. I snapped my hanger in the process. Wow. Need something with a longer reach. Uh. Key? Anything with more reach. A bra. <laughs> I don't know. What I got? I got the horn, but it'll no, spill everywhere. No, yeah, stuff in it. Nothing? Well, I gotta get something else then. Hmm. We might not be live. The stream is disconnected. <gasps> is it? Yeah. That's okay. We, well, we're still recording, so let's just play. Yeah. So, I need something new. Who do you do? Maybe the drunk man will give me something. Mm -hmm. Hmm. I think we had 15 minutes mm -hmm. left in our stream, mm -hmm. anyway. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Longer reach. Wait, did you did you say you were going to get something off the guy's plate? Yeah, I thought it was late, but maybe I don't. Yeah, I can just drink it. No, it needs one more ingredient. And you're, I, I have a feeling you're going to be the one drinking it. Yeah. It's a rose bud. Can't you just put the roses in it? I guess I'll try that now. Yeah. Now that I have the other thing put together. Yeah. That would be my assumption. Oh, I didn't even notice that, but when you walk under the lights, his hair also changes. Oh, yeah. That's actually cool. Yeah. Like, they didn't have to do that. Nice little effect. Mm. Especially for a pixel game. Get it. No? Really? Can you put it there? Nope. You can't use it on the flowers? What, well, this? Yeah. No? <sighs> for real? Hmm. What does the barman say again? Oh. Oh. Did the music stop? <laughs> that was I weird. Oh. Hmm. Don't know what's going on there. No, I neither. Didn't talk to him. Hi. Beta, you killing my vibe. Fuck you. You wouldn't like that. Hmm. Just give it to this guy. Yeah, give it to him. What do you what think do you of think this? Hmm. <laughs> so delicious. Positively titillating. <laughs> Smells a bit weird, though. <laughs> what do you think of this? Hmm? I think it's making my eyes water. Twin one. What do you think of this love note? How flattering. No, he offered it to <laughs> me. Well, that's ridiculous. I'm clearly the more handsome twin. But I'm the tallest. Barely. 
you're taller, it's maybe by a single pixel. Then, yeah, it's... <laughs> you know what? Never mind. You, Barton. Yeah, the barman. What do you think of this? On this. <laughs> thanks, but no thanks. So you're just offering that to everybody? Yeah. Maybe that'll get you something. Maybe, maybe the old lady. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> what if it was? Look at this. Hmm. Very good, sir. <laughs> she probably couldn't even read it. Aww. Oh. Oi! I might not, I might be deaf, but I'm certainly not blind. Well, not with the glasses, anyway. <laughs> what do you think of this? Professionally, I'd recommend wearing gloves <laughs> when handling anything so potent. Mm, that's great. Can I combine What it? about the old guy? The old guy! What if the old guy yeah. likes it and he's like, ha, ha, ha. Maybe this is strong enough to sober you up. <laughs> he wouldn't like that. What about the other guy? Like, sorry, sir. Lady blah blah blah. I'm a attorney. No exceptions. Oh. oh, maybe the love letter will get him away. You think? Maybe? Maybe. Maybe. Um, maybe. Mm. There you go. Looks like you have a <laughs> secret admirer. <gasps> oh. Wow. <laughs> this is uh, explicit, I know. And the perfume. It's so awful. Alluring. Wait for me in room 4C. Watch this post for me while I'm gone. <laughs> of course. She wants on the window. I know. She and does. don't go in there, Mr. Ackerman. Wouldn't dream of it. <clears throat> what a dummy. What do you doing? Hmm? I can see if there's any evidence in Lady Untervald's quarters. Okay, there's a lot of flowers. I don't know in here. what happened to the audio. I don't know either. That's really weird. One moment you're running an empire, the next you're rolled up in an ugly rug. Oh. <laughs> like Dude. a sad hot dog. <laughs> oh, there she is. Oh my god. There she is. Oh, there's that long. There's a long thing. Mm -hmm. Her cane. A walking nice. cane could come in handy. Yeah, you can beat somebody with it. Hope you don't mind, Lydia. I'm too old. Take. She'd probably be fine with it. She's under my desk. Get, get her petals, get petals, get petals. Retirement gift. Monster up plant. Half empty briefcase. Don't close it or anything. Right. <laughs> Maybe one turn off hat. Blah, blah, blah. Retirement gift. Nothing, really? Oh, what was that? Loose spells. <gasps> Loose spells, nice. Noise. Nice. Looks like he's pissing on the plants. <laughs> <laughs> I can't use those together? Oh, the bartender might. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Don't know what happened to the music, but it's gone. Eh. It is what it is. Ambient um, train noise. Yeah, it's just the... It sounds um, nice. It's right. the soundtrack that's not working. Yeah, well, you know, it happens. Hey, go over the bar bartender, bartender! Uh, I was going to get the stick thing. Oh, no, bartender first. Because it's right here. Hello. What'll it be? A wrong Rose bun. Right, voila. Are the ingredients? Can you make more then? Blah, 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 blah. Okay. There you go. Um, okay. Um, okay. What these petals do? Hmm. I can work with that. Now, I can't legally give you the real deal if you're anywhere under the <laughs> pounds. Oh, but you have the rest, though. You'll never be given. So what can you give me? I'll make you a rosebud light. <laughs> <laughs> it has mm. all of the flavor of the rosebud. But you'll still be able to, you know, form sentences precisely. Love it. You just nice. Mm. You combine it. With the it's delicious. delicious. Oh. I might be able to make it stronger with some experimentation. Well, we're, we're back. back. We're back on Twitch. I don't know what happened there. 
Something to mix it all up in. Nice! Oh, I could go for like a really nice wine. Ooh. Like not the crappy Asda wine we've been I wanna I wanna do mixology again. <laughs> Ding -ding. Okay. Yeah, there's nothing. Oh my gosh, are you gonna like be like super like I hope it changes. Hmm. Don't feel any different. I hope I was I was really hoping that everything's gonna change. <laughs> Ten minutes later. I hope stuff changes. Aww. You're my, You're my best, best friend. friend. Yes, Arthur. We're all very pleased that you're finally having a good time. But I can't understand a word you're saying. None of us can. Oh, uh, I must be drunk. No, I must be drunk. I must be drunk. <laughs> Talk to everyone when you're washed <laughs> up. <laughs> Big kid. They, they probably don't have really anything to say. What's up? Sorry, old chap. Can't understand a word. <laughs> Is she way out? You're scaring me. He's scaring me more. It's not this again. Mm -hmm. I should get the will. No, I'll talk to the man first. The will's probably like a be all end all. Yeah. Maybe. Uh. <laughs> My good man, <laughs> are you enjoying my signature drink? Signature. I th is he a Sean You're Connery finally type? finally sobered up? He's a Sean Connery He looks Connery like Sean type. Connery. Well, of course you're not. Yeah, he's a Sean Connery. We're just the same amount of drunk. Oh. I guess that makes sense. <laughs> sort of. <laughs> Herman Merman said he saw you earlier in the evening. I remember I saw you earlier in the evening. <laughs> Not long before he lost his keys. Well, most definitely. I was aware of the fact of detective. <laughs> cursing and bashing about the headquarters last night. Uh, tell me about the crashing and bashing you heard. See, maybe you can't see Bastion Yard. Oh, it was awful. It drove me to drink of despair. You did? Well, I was already <laughs> drinking. <laughs> me? Got my revenge, though. Got him leaves in the hallway. Took them when he wasn't looking. Ooh. Herman's keys. <laughs> Ew. Take them, lad. I'm going to ask you a question. Make soon. sure you crack the case. You might want to sober up first, though. Do you want to pause here and save the rest for tomorrow since we're at time? Let's just. Because um, we don't know how much longer we have left. Well, let me grab the will and, uh, that'll be it. Okay. Because there might literally be, like, two seconds left. Mm. All right. So I got a big old stick. Mm. Oh, God damn it! Should be able to reach with this. I'll need some way to hook it. Oh, fuck's sake. Mm -hmm. There. Ooh. Loosely attach the wire to the stick to create a hook. But I'll need something else to secure it in place. Oh, for God's sake. Is there anything else? Nope. Nope. So. Yeah, call it there, call I guess. It? Okay. That was cool. I yeah. had fun. I'm, I'm having fun with this one. We don't know how long is left. It assume. doesn't seem like there's very long left. Maybe a half hour. I doubt it. I think it's Maybe a half hour. Left. You think it's ten minutes? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. I, do you want to finish it? I, I think we can finish it. You think we can finish it? Okay. Yeah. Well, we're just going to keep going. Especially since, uh, yeah, if you were watching on Twitch, um, we cut out there for quite a few minutes. Um, but luckily, we are recording these. Um, so the VOD will be on YouTube. Which, of course, is Java and Wine. So just look us up there. He said he should sober up. Do his coffee at the bar. Oh, yeah. That'll work. Unless you took it all. <sighs> hmm. I'm gonna have a piece of cake after this. Coffee. 
<laughs> really <laughs> strong coffee. Because that's how coffee works. Yes, yes. Coffee actually does not help you sober up when you are drunk. The way your liver works when you consume alcohol does not work that way. That is killing me. I really embarrass myself. <laughs> As somebody who worked at a winery, that's not how alcohol works. <laughs> yeah. The only way you can sober up is with time. Rosemary doesn't help either. Rosemary? You know, and time. I can't use it. Why not? I said it was such a straight face. That's weird. I couldn't use the keys on the door, but I could open the door. Oh. Okay. Who's? Wow, this place is in this room. Uh -oh. oh, this is you. Someone must have been looking for something. <gasps> oh, no. It's Herman Merman's. Rikius. It's locked. I've got keys now. <laughs> they put it in his pants. Oh, <laughs> no. Maybe I can uh, find someone or something to break it open. You think there's really only ten minutes left, hon? I'd say there's at least a good half hour left. I think so. Mm -hmm. Okay. We'll call it there, then. Yeah, I think we should call it there. That was that. Okay, so this is Locomotive. Again, this is a free game found on Itch.io, so feel free to go ahead and check that out if you'd like, and you can play it for yourself. And probably solve stuff a lot faster than we did. So thank you guys for watching, and we will catch you tomorrow. So, see you later. Bye. Welcome, everybody, to Java and Wine, where we are back again to finish off Locomotive, the game we started last night. And we are going to possibly play A Memory of Our Life. It's the, f the last memory, I think, in that first chapter. Yeah. Um, we are working on a delay tonight. And also, we are working on um, an alternate schedule for the holiday tomorrow. So we're not going to be streaming as long. Yes. So we're only going to be streaming for about an hour tonight instead of our usual two. Um, you know, give or take. Depending on gameplay and stuff. So anyway, tonight's beverages include a Carlsberg export and what's left of my Bordeaux wine. Um, I used some to make a gravy one night, so this is all I got left. Uh -huh. <laughs> I do have other wine, but I'm not really feeling much in the St. Patrick's Day spirit because I woke up from a nap 20 minutes ago. <laughs> I am... I let her sleep on 10 minutes. And I was like, oh crap, we got to get ready. And then I was like, oh, I still need wine. Okay. And then I was like, oh, I gotta get dressed. Yeah, <laughs> I already yeah, had I my makeup. I already looked fabulous because I woke up like this. <laughs> <laughs> so we got. You actually did. <laughs> so we got the will. Yes. Uh, did we? No, we didn't. Oh, we didn't get the will? No, I made a hook. I made a stick with a hook on it, but I need something to tie the hook to the stick. Well, where's the will? It's hanging out of the window. It's a, it's a different window. Oh, it's okay. So we're in a different cabin. Uh, maybe I need it. some string. It was in the sleaze balls. Yeah, there we go. Yeah. Okay. And I you can't need get something it. longer. Okay. And it is so, strength. um, we need more stuff. I still have the horn. What what is it called? Fully corked horn. Fully corked horn. Because I had the booze. Okay, because it had booze in it. What else do we have? Can we have we... a briefcase. Yeah. Uh, Herman's, Herman's locked, locked briefcase. Brief keys. So, keys? We just have Herman's keys, right? We only have. Do the keys work on his briefcase? No, they were for his room. But do they work on his key? Did you try combining them? <gasps> Great idea, but it's a combination. Um, okay, so there. We tried cards. everything. Okay, so we. Need to break it open somehow. I need to break it open somehow. Do you have a tool? Nope. No? Alright. Okay. I shall search. And here we are. Uh, Tony thought we had maybe like a good half hour left of this game. Not even, but... I think it's pretty near done. Okay. We'll, we'll be the judge of that, won't we? You mentioned the sleeping card, so I assume I can go there now. Nope. Nothing but sleeper carriages down there. Well, besides, there's a killer on the way. Yeah, I think the assumption is that you would go to sleep at home. In the sleaze balls corners. Remember, 
So you just need something. Is there anything in what's her faces? The the deceased woman's. Oh, oh where's sleaze ball? Ooh. Oh. You ran off to fuck that attendant guy. What? Oh, that's right. Well, I mean, you know. <laughs> mm. Oh, she's in there. Is there anything? There's nothing? I think I have to talk to people again. Okay. Yeah, that usually helps. Mr. Mason. Have you sobered up yet? Perhaps. Still not on this level. Oh, well, that's mm. just repeating what we've already done. So the music's just not on anymore. Yeah. Hello. I've already said all that shit. Okay. But I can show them stuff. He wouldn't like that. She wouldn't like that. He wouldn't like that. He wouldn't like <laughs> that. Can I give him a flagon? No. No. She probably <laughs> won't want it back now that I've sealed it. Can you talk, talk to her? Yeah, I'll talk to her later. Why are you so eager to ruin an old lady's fun? Is this about the horn? What? I'm going to leave now. <laughs> I kind of like this noise, though. It's like kind of ambient. <laughs> it's calming. It's like white noise. Yeah, which, you, you can, as you know, I can't sleep we without have a, it. We have a turn down a lot. But you can kind of tell it's a train if you crank it mm. up. We don't crank it up too loud. They won't hear anything. I know, but we also really haven't checked the, the level over there. Hmm. You know, on that side, on the stream yeah. side. Yeah. Because normally, you know. Wallop like, Bay. Never mind. Hmm. Can I just give it to anyone? Say. Ooh. Do either of you know anyone who could open this briefcase? <laughs> so I forgot. I'll give it a shot. Let me try first. Now he clearly asked me. I'm the best person for the job. The second best person for the job. You won't be saying that when I open it. <laughs> because I'd have already opened it. It's mine. 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 Uh. Maybe it just pops open. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, now look what you did. It was me. It was too. I think my work here is done. It looked like a CD. Mm. Couldn't be, though. Detective strength ah. tuck tip. Mm, I see. Oh! Well, I can use that. Yeah. That's pretty much what I need. Nice. Looks like he's jacking it. No. <laughs> okay, so this should secure the hook in place. Time to bring that will in from the cold. Let's do it. Finally. Did you, did you say the sleaze ball and the other guy are in the sleeper carriages? <laughs> Maybe. They must be in a different room though. You think they're uh this is the sleaze balls. Um freaky acquainted. <laughs> yes. Yeah. No, don't fuck what it if up. it doesn't work? What if it like floats oh, by gonna... and you see the oh? I thought it would have been funny if it would have floated by and the guys were like doing it. Where there's a will, there's a way. <laughs> oh. Oh. That's right. Anything's possible, Herman Merman. But we all saw you die. Not really. Did you? Or did you watch a master at work? I have the will, Herman. It'll re reveal the murderer. Indeed. <gasps> I oh, thought so. <laughs> that's what I'm afraid of. I was thinking that. No. That's not true. That's impossible, Star Wars. <laughs> it's true. Oh, she didn't even kill herself. In my own room. Oh. Oh, the sleeve ball. Well, I'll find an even smaller space to duct tape you in. Yeah. As no, for that's you, you so. Arthur. Mm -hmm. No, the yellow is the sleaze ball. Oh. Outside. <laughs> Psh. 
Oh, I love it. <laughs> what the heck's going on? It's an old fashioned uh, train fight. You've been a thorn in my side since the moment we met. It would be a pleasure to kill you. <laughs> no witnesses, after all. Wait! <laughs> I have questions. Questions? What questions? You, <laughs> you trashed your room? <laughs> to throw off the scent? No, no. It was just me losing my temper. Uh, why did you kill Lady Unterwald? I spent years spying on her family. Reporting on any and all indiscriminations. Indiscretions. Indiscretions. If anyone so much as stepped out of line, she'd know about it. Also, she could keep her wrinkled hands clean. We had a deal. Ooh. It was you that she wrote out of her will. Oh, shoot. Oh, yes. Lady Unterwald decided she was done with me. Felt remorse for all the underhanded spying, she said. Written night, just like that. I merely returned the favor. Oh, he wrote her out of Why? life. Why the need to fake your death? Lady Underwald was already dead. I was ready to switch the original with a copy. Mm -hmm. Trusting that Lady Unterwald's paranoia would ensure nobody had seen the original. Losing the will made things complicated. I simply wasn't prepared for your incompetence. <laughs> Nobody suspects a dead man. It brought it bought me some more time. Anyway, time's up. Uh, goodbye, Mr. Ackerman. Wit. <laughs> what are you <laughs> doing? <laughs> I'll take a leak. Oh, I ain't got that. Pants fell down. <laughs> oh. Uh. I have the power of attorney. That's Prepare to buckle under. <laughs> you betrayed the law, said Judge Dredd. What do you want to choose? Oh, I have the power of attorney. <laughs> nice! <laughs> <laughs> that's good. That's real good. <laughs> uh, that's amazing. I wonder what that awesome boy's up to. I hope he took my advice about making new friends. Mm. <laughs> that looks creepy and disgusting. <laughs> what? He's like dangling me off the edge. <laughs> Hello? Is anyone there? Oh, wait, no, that's wrong voice. <gasps> I have your note, my love. Oh. That's nice. But I'm very badly wounded. Oh. Because he said he tied him up in the closet. <laughs> Why do you persist in living? Get back up here and face me. Uh, mm. I'm gonna just... Why couldn't you keep your nose out of mm. it? Nah. Nah. Oh. Your soul's... I <laughs> just chuck it at him. <laughs> <laughs> oh, here, here comes, comes the tunnel. The He's going to get squished. Oh. <laughs> Whoops. Oh, no. That's gross. He lost his head. <laughs> oh. Nice. Looks like Herman came up short. <laughs> uh, like you got to do that. <laughs> I'm sorry, sir. We found Herman's body. Well, half of it. <laughs> but we couldn't recover the will. Oh. That's okay, Maurice. I have it right here. Oh, yeah. La gasp! Well, before I read the will, I want to say that I've, already, I've really learned something here. What was that, Arthur? Gonna have a good time. Let me mix your own drinks. 
Switzerland is bigger than it looks on the map. Oh, but I thought it was good. <laughs> Don't expect much from a video game made in two weeks. <laughs> it's really good. It's really good for a two-week-old game, especially the writing. It's mm. pretty funny. Never... I'm going to pick this one just because it's... Now it breaks the wall. Yeah, it breaks the wall. <laughs> Quite right, young man. It's a fool's errand. Madness. Mad That's yes. me. I knew that before you did. Get on with it. Ah. Well, reading. It reads as follows. I, Lady Underwald, being of sound mind and legal capacity, leave my entire state to Arthur Ackerman. <gasps> you poisonous goat. You turned her against us. I... Uh oh, he's going to die. Oh, he's going to die. Oh, 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 look, another channel. <laughs> That's like, yeah, they're going to oh, cut past the end of the game. Oh, we'll never know. <laughs> That's pretty funny. <laughs> That was good. Adam, that was pretty fucking impressive, I thought. That was good. Joseph, that, Joseph and Joseph Adam, the I'm code. assuming they are related in some way. Additional art. The, art. the art was really good as well. Paul Zimmerman, your music was good. Moral support. Good job, Amber and Maya. You did great. <laughs> Power quest. Thanks, Dave Lloyd. That was pretty damn good for two weeks. That was good. That was. You guys should be really happy with what you produced because it, it was fun. If was this a was a, like a university project or something, you must have passed. <laughs> oh, I sure hope so. The only the only thing I saw was like maybe a couple grammar mistakes, but like they were they so were minor. Yeah, they were so minor. It's like that's that's li like literally one, the one only thing. One L instead of two. If I had to nitpick, if I had to nitpick, and that that would be it. But other than that, it was funny. Mm -hmm. I like I like. I like um, games that have a sense of humor. Um, it was fun. It was genuinely like difficult at times trying to figure out what we needed to do. But not too. But innocuous. not out of reach. Not out of the realm of like, oh, I can't figure this out. You know. Yeah. I mean, the way to solve it is to just run yourself through video game logic. Mm -hmm. and talk then... to people. Talk to the other characters and stuff. And yeah, and they drop hints and stuff. Mm -hmm. So it was. It was good. You guys should be really happy and proud of what you made so if that, you've made other games we should check them out yeah robust yeah. games present so anyway we found this on itch.io this was on itch.io it was free to play make sure you spell itch.io correct so make sure yeah <laughs> so make sure to hop on over there and give this a play if you'd like to so thank you for watching locomotive we'll be back with a different game very soon brb Yes, BRB. Yeah, <laughs>